Hi, my name is Mike Mahan with SMA America's Solar Academy. In the tech tip today, we're going to talk about registering an SMA inverter with WebConnect technology to the Sunny Portal. WebConnect is SMA's communication technology that allows direct data exchange between an SMA inverter and the Sunny Portal. Once you have the inverter with WebConnect technology commissioned, like this Sunny Boy 5000 TLUS with the WebConnect data module, you're ready to register the inverter with the Sunny Portal. The process we're going to go through to register the inverter is the same whether or not the inverter has a WebConnect data module or a WebConnect piggyback card. So let's walk through the steps. Step one of the registration process is to go to sunnyportal.com. On that page in the lower right, you'll see the tile labeled Plant Setup Assistant. Click on that and click Next. Here we are at step one. I am already registered with the Sunny Portal, so I'll enter the email address I used to register. And my password. And click Next. For step two, I'll need to enter a plant name. and give it a password. We recommend setting a strong password rather than leaving it as a default password. This will increase plant security. When you've entered that and verified it, click Next. And we're on to step three. On step three, you'll need the PIC and RID codes that are on the WebConnect data module or piggyback card. You also should have a sticker with both of those codes handy. That's easier to look at. Enter those codes. When you've entered the two codes, click on the Identify button. At this point, Sunny Portal is actually going and searching for the device. If Sunny Portal is successful in finding the device, you'll see an icon with the device type. We see Sunny Boy 5000 TLUS. So Sunny Portal has found, identified this plant. If you have multiple inverters, you simply enter the RID and PIC for those and continue the process until you've identified all of the inverters. When you've identified all of the inverters you wish to register, click Next. You'll notice here we've skipped steps four, five, and six. Those steps are only applicable when you're registering a Sunny Multigate with the SMA240 microinverter. Step seven has information about the plant that the Sunny Portal needs to calculate projected yields. You'll need to verify for your install location what the specific annual yield will be. Here I'm entering 1800 and the appropriate zip code and city for the install. Finally, the appropriate time zone. And last but not least, you will need to check the box for automatic updates. That allows Sunny Portal to make sure that the firmware on your communications device is current. If you wish to disable that later, you can by logging into Sunny Portal, but you need to click it in this process. And click Next. And we're on to step eight. And this is just an overview of the information you've entered. When you are happy with it, click on Finish. And you'll see that Sunny Portal is actually uploading information. And it says this can take a few minutes. And you see a progress bar. Wait till it's done. There we go. We have the 100%. And you see a verification that the Sunny Portal has registered the new plant. And then you can click the To the Plant button, and you will see the page in Sunny Portal. Obviously, if it's a newly commissioned plant, there won't be any history for the energy production or the CO2 avoided. But you should see a green check mark for the plant status. That shows that communication between the Sunny Portal and the plant is occurring correctly. There are a couple of things to remember as you go through the registration. The plant password you select in the Plant Setup Assistant also becomes the password you will use to access the plant locally with Sunny Explorer. You can register a maximum of four WebConnect devices per plant. If you need to register more than four, simply run the Setup Assistant again and enter a new plant name for each group of four. And that's all you need to do. Your SMA plant with WebConnect technology is now registered on the Sunny Portal, and you can access the plant data anywhere you have an internet connection with an iOS device or Android device using our apps or on your normal computer. And that's it for this tech tip. 
If you'd like to learn more about the Sunny Portal or WebConnect technology, please check our website, sma-america.com, under the Solar Academy tab for upcoming trainings. My name is Mike Mahan with SMA America's Solar Academy. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again soon.